okay uh, so uh, this is a uh, poor man's uh, body uh, plot analyzer or a network analyzer that i have created recently and uh, what you can see is a stm32 f407 discovery board so uh, the very simple uh, explanation of the body analyzer is there is a uh, sinusoidal frequency output from the board and it goes to a circuit over here this is the circuit it's a very simple circuit and the output of that circuit goes back to the ADC and uh, the software inside it calculates the magnitude and the phase uh, with respect to the input the output and input are compared and the data is sent to the PC uh, via this uh, serial uh, USB to serial port and uh, the Python script here uh, records uh, the, uh, the waveform uh, in a uh, presentable manner so uh, uh, the body plot uh, analyzer in my case uh, it generates a frequency right from 1 hertz to 10 kilohertz uh, I know there is this uh, so it's um, it's also called as the chirp signal that is the amplitude remains the same 1 volts in my case but the frequency keeps on increasing now I had put one external one filter just to filter out some uh, high, high, higher harmonics but that seemed to be actually uh, tapering down the frequency here quite a bit so I have to change that but nevertheless uh, the thing is working fine so I just thought I will present it here and the reason for choosing the STM32 board is because um, this board has a floating point and it has a very good DAC of 1.3 microsecond settling time and ADC which, is, which goes up to 2 mega samples per second perfect for this kind of waveform generation so I'll just give you a demo of how the thing works um, I will uh, put the python and there is a python script that I have already written uh, let me just show you it's pretty simple uh, there is not, nothing much in the python to show you it has a bunch of uh, the frequencies that I am generating uh, and then uh, it sends a command to start the probing that is generation of different frequencies and then it uh, once that is done once the board generates the frequencies calculates the input and output and it uh, sends the data via serial port over here and this is what I get and it just plots the data let me show you the demo so I am going to run it and it gives uh, some commands over here and uh, the, there is a LED which, in, which glows and indicates that uh, the probing has started and once that is done it gives me an output which is a body plot and there is a magnitude which is in decibels now the calculation of decibels and the phase degree here is um, little involved so I am splitting it up between this device versus and some part in the python as well and uh, the circuit here is very simple it's a simple RC so it's a first order filter and as you can see the frequency drop is 20 or minus 20 dB per decade and the corner frequency is somewhere here where we get about minus 3 dB and same thing coincides here about 40 or 45 degree over here and as you can see so the, the it matches with whatever I have set in the hardware so it comes to about uh, you know 200 this is 100 this 200 and maybe about 220 or 250 hertz so that's the corner frequency of this filter so it's working pretty good uh, I hope you like it all my uh, the python script the software which is running here all the explanation is up on my website so hopefully you you will like it and you will find it useful thank you